All right, hello. Um, I have been trying <laughs> for like an hour to get um, this recording business to work because my laptop is not a gaming laptop and playing Minecraft alone takes up like half the CPU and recording it takes up the other half. So I'm going to do my best to not let this crash and to not lose all the footage. Um, we'll see how it goes. So like every 30 seconds or so there's going to be a cut. Um, but that's for the purposes of not losing the footage. Uh, yeah. And I think it'll um, give my computer a break if um, it won't crash as long as I watch the clock and I don't let any recording get past a minute or like 40 seconds. We'll see. We'll just see how it goes. Anyways, here is my Minecraft creation. Um, this is in one of my single player modes, uh, survival mode. I have my carrot with me. Um, yeah, and I, I built this thing. This was the building that I showed you guys um, in the group chat at one time. But now I'm on top of it, so I grew trees on the top, and then there's my bed. And then you get up, you go up and down this column of water. I have my, um, have my chest and everything here. I have my mine down there, which I'll show you eventually. A little flower walk. Um, and I got the boys over here. I have my llamas. They are adorable. And then this one was a wild llama, um, but I made him a carpet because he deserves only the best. I have my fork here. And, um, yeah, things are looking good over here. Got my chicken and stuff. I'm trying to make more chickens, but it's not really working. Um, I have my farm right here. I thought it was cool. It was kind of like a natural crater that was already here. I thought it was cool to have like a little waterfall feature and a little farm. I'll plant my carrot over here. Um, yeah. This is just... So in Minecraft, like, the world starts is basically wild. Like, it's just the trees and natural area. And, um, then you can get tree, like, you get wood and mine, and then you just end up building a bunch of things. It's, like, a good analog for real life. Um, oh, shit. Wow, that was... that could have been disastrous. Um, this is my mine. You go up and down the mines on these um, ladders, and as you can see, if you don't do that, you get fall damage and you almost die. So, um, this is my mines, and they go pretty down, they go pretty deep. And you have to do that, because certain ores and stuff are only found in, like, the lowest levels of the game. Um, and, hold on. So... Basically, like, one of the techniques is something called strip mining, and it's just mining in, like, a straight line, and eventually you'll hit something. Sometimes it's bad, like lava, which you can die in. Um, and so, okay, these blocks here are redstone, and uh, they are, they're kind of like electronics, basically, here. So, like, there's redstone wires, and um, you can, like, power certain machines and stuff in the game, um, and people make all cool things with it. People can, like make like uh like roller coaster rides of sorts with the mine carts. Um yeah. So this is just one of those mines that I made. <clears throat> and I don't think really much is going on. I haven't played on the single player one in a while, but every time I try to do multiplayer, like my computer crashes out while trying to record. So I'm just gonna show you this and I also um I've been meaning to get back on this too and I'm probably gonna end up just making an entirely new house um and I'll show you where that is but yeah so this is this is mine and while I come back up um let's see yeah I've been trying to record you doing the multiplayer but um Again, because it's like I'm at like 100% CPU right now, I don't want to push it. And like this is just single player. 
Anyways, um, here, so I'll show you what happens when you die. I've been, meaning, I've been trying to build a bridge to that island over there. Um, but what happens when you die? So, like, die by drowning, by running into lava, by getting killed by a mob. Let's see what happens first. Um, yeah, there's stuff underwater too, but as you can see, my air is running out. Um, which means I will probably die soon. And, um,. Okay, and my mouse isn't working now either. That's great. Cool. Sorry, every, every once in a while, every few seconds, the game will like freeze. Or it'll just start doing weird things. Um, I'm gonna build a boat. <laughs> oh, and that voice you heard, that means there's another trader llama. Boy, well, where's your llamas? You're supposed to have llamas, that's where I got the other llamas from. So, like, they have, like, a little... Oh, there they are. He lost them. Oh, I can get them. Oh, shit, man. We got... We're having a real llama party here. They're mine now. Fuck, oh, yeah. You just witnessed... One of the greatest things ever. Mm. Usually I have to kill the other llama, the llama trader. And then the mm. llamas get mad at you because they're like, bro. You, you, and then they, they spit at you. Um, and then you have to eventually tame the llamas. So they'll disappear if I don't. Oh, jeez, it's been out there so many llamas. <laughs> so basically I have to keep attempting to ride the llamas. Until they don't write them. It's a, it's a process. Yay! So see those hearts? So that means, um, he accepted me. So that's cool. Um. Okay, why can't I do left shift? I just... Okay, the game's not letting me. Okay, there we go. One sec. Alright. Uh, okay, so I got those llamas. Um, I tamed them. Um, I didn't want to keep recording because I think, like, the whole process of, like, writing and taming them, it, like, kind of wigged the game out a little bit. So, but, um, those are tamed, and I think my next project will actually be to make a larger enclosure for them, because as you can see, they can hop up on, like, pumpkins and stuff. They can also jump on each other, so I'm just worried that, like, if they jump up on each other, they can end up jumping over the fence. Um, and I don't want them, and they look, look at them, they're all crowded in there, so I'll probably make them a nice enclosure over here. I really chose a bad spot because, like, I wanted to build on the beach because I thought I was going to build, like, this huge ass thing, but, um, I'm not going to do that because I actually care more about, like, building things for the animals, to be honest, so I'll probably end up, like, trying like, terraforming all this, make it look more like a forest biome. Yeah, anyways, um, I need to, well, first of all, I need to put the leads away, because they're very valuable. Um, they're hard to make, because they require a certain kind of mob called the, what the fuck are they called? The giant squishy thing. Um, slimes, that's what they're called. And, uh, they're kind of rare, they don't generate very often, um, so... I'd rather just get the leads as they naturally generate from the trader. So I'm gonna just zoom on over. So this is the other part, another island. It's actually all connected. But there's this thing called spawn uh, or chunk areas where, um, like chunks of the land don't generate. Oh fuck. So like as you can see, this is like a straight line, like up and down right here. And this is actually just a big box. Like, this should be all one landmass. But, um, instead, if there's a chunk here, it just spawns an ocean. So, yeah. Anyway, so here I am on the other side of the island. Um, I just remembered I did not build anything over here. Because the only thing that I came over here for was to... Oh, fuck, what the heck? That's so weird, that totally just glitched on me. That usually doesn't happen. Um, 
I only came over here to explore. So what I did is I did like a trail of torches. Um, starting beyond here a little bit. Because you can ride horses in the game, so basically I had a horse. And I just kind of trail run. Oh shit, hold on. Alright, so it's almost night time. The sun's going down. It's 10 minutes. Uh, the day and night cycles are 10 minutes each. But I swear to god, the, the day feels way shorter than the night. Um, so I'm just gonna zoom over so I can sleep and just skip the night time because, again, mobs spawn at night and I would rather not have to deal with them and just be able to work outside and not have to worry about dying. But I gotta wait though. I gotta wait for the sun to completely set. <sighs> yeah. How many llamas do I got now? I got I got six. Wow. That's impressive. Okay, so I'm pretty sure the screen recorder crashed, but basically all I said was that um I'm going to I want to build on the other island over there. But I'm gonna have to take the llamas with me. And the thing is is that the llamas are kind of clumsy, so they won't follow me in like a straight line, and that little narrow bridge, one of them will probably fall off, and they can swim, but like once they're in the water, they don't follow you anymore. Um, so like, it, it'll just be kind of a pain. So I'm just gonna expand the bridge a little bit, um, before I make my way over there. And I think I'm just gonna build like a whole new house over there, because I don't like this one anymore. And... I don't like this area, this beach area anymore, so, um, that'll be cool. And this is just gonna be a pain because, oh, well, actually, I think it'll be fine if I just do two planks wide. They should be fine with that. Alright, so this is my fucked up bridge. I ran out of wood, so I just cobblestone the rest of it. Um, why am, I not, why am I not running? There we go. So now, I just gotta zoom over. Well, actually, first I should build what I want to build over there first. So I'm gonna first build everything, and then I'll bring the llamas over. So I need to have the be ready to go for them, or else I'm just gonna have nowhere to put them. And then they'll wander away, and then I'll be fine. So I gotta make some tools. So first things first, we will need plenty of axes because we're gonna need to get a lot of wood. I was trying to get some music going, but unfortunately, I'm pretty sure the last recording it crashed and deleted everything. Basically, all I said is that um. I came over the bridge, and I'm going to build a bunch of stuff over here. But I have to decide where I want to build everything. I'm going to build everything first before I start moving all my stuff over. Um, so I could start building over there, because I like that area. But I also know there's a really nice looking area over here. Oh, look at this! So this is called a flower forest biome, and there's so many flowers. And it's so nice. And I got some nice hills over there too, and fuck, I need my bed. Bitch. I swear to god if a monster spawns right next to me while I sleep. Okay. We good. We chillin'. Um, okay. So... Yeah, I'll probably end up building somewhere around here. Oh, fuck. <laughs> it's just like, it's such a nice area, like, who would not want to live here? You know that field area is really nice. This is also a nice field area. Yeah. I could put some fish in here, I could have a little fishing pond. I mean, this, oh, this is so nice. Okay, so I'll probably build here. I'll build on that side. 
Yeah, I got horses up here too. Look at that. It's a mama horse and a baby horse. Hold on. This is probably a cave. Okay. Well, that's noted. Um, look at these. Oh, these two babies. Oh my gosh, these two baby horses. Holy shit. Yeah, this place is so much better than the beach. Oh, this will be nice. Because if I build my house here, I'll have, um... I'll be right on this lake. Anyways, as I was saying, I'd be right on this little river too. So that'd be nice. I'll build up, uh, I'll build up up here. So now, comes the fun part. This is the crafting part. Now, there's kind of a strategy to building houses. Um, you make sure that it's, uh, it's, the walls are like, they're odd numbered, and you have, um, symmetry around a uh, the center point and um, it just looks better it's easier to do um, it's easier to set up houses around odd number symmetry so we'll have that oh what the fuck oh that was just a lag okay jeez because usually that sound means there's a skeleton nearby and those fuckers are scary as shit. So I'll just really quickly set up some things here before I go chop some wood up. And I'll just quickly place a bunch of stuff here in case something happens while I'm gone and I die. Which is very likely, unfortunately. I have not mastered the art of combat in this game yet, and um, I'm doing better, but I still die really easily. Hopefully I don't start a forest fire, but we'll see. So I'll just chop down some trees over here. And the little ones grew up. That was fast. So now tree chopping can be dangerous because there can be creepers creeping around the forests. Um, so you gotta be gotta be watchful. But if you run enough, like if you can react quickly enough, you probably won't die if you see a creature, even if it explodes, like we're right next to you, because um the damage is when they explode. Um, you'll probably die if they explode right next to you, but if you're like a couple blocks away, you'll still feel the impact and you'll still get health damage, um, but you won't die. So, just gotta... You can run, but you can't hide. Oh, that happens. And then, uh, tree drops also drop when you cut one down, so I try to plant those around as well. That way you get more trees! Should be So I'm gonna do three, okay, so it's gonna be seven by one, two, three. One, two, three. And then we'll have a square house. Perfect. Oh wait. I'm telling you, I just it's just stumpage hours. Always. Okay, I apologize, but like the past five minutes of gameplay got lost because the recording app crashed and um yeah, it's just wigging out right now, but, um... Okay, why is it getting darker? It's so weird. Okay, anyways. Yeah, so I built this house, I killed some chickens, I'm cook I got some coal to cook the chickens in, or to cook the chickens with. And, um, I have to light up the area around the house, or else things will spawn in the night. And, um, that's not good. 
So just gotta light it up. Yes, this is oh this is good. They will love this. So I'm gonna make my llama pen in here. Now I'll put it I'll start it here. All right, so you know what? I'll leave some grass. I can't really replant the grass actually. So I'm just I gotta make some fences. And how much stone we got? Uh, a lot. <laughs> we got eight stone blocks. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna bring the other stone that I have um, on the other side. Eventually, oh, geez, I'm an idiot. I made way too many sticks. Oh, actually, not. It's actually perfect. I'm not an idiot. Okay, what the fuck? Can't I walk through this fucking door? Oh my god. Alright, so I made a lot of fences, but they weren't enough, so I gotta make more of these. I'm gonna decorate it and wait till we see it, because I don't think the last recording got it. It's so nice, they're gonna have such a nice, like, large space. And, uh, ooh, another, like, See, I like this biome, because there's a lot of lakes, a lot of flowers, a lot of trees. Just very pretty looking. Way better than the beach biome. Look at this. This is going to be a really nice open pasture for them. Oh, oh that's fine. I wonder if I should have that up against the house. That would be cute. No, I shouldn't. I should be able to walk behind the house. Alright, time to make some torches. And, um, I need to make some pets and gates. So I'll put a gate here. And I'll put one here. Basically, basically, I'm putting a gate at like all, like the best entry points, in case I want to bring other animals in here um, from any direction. I need to have a gate. So okay, cool. Then we'll light it up. So next, I'm gonna need to mine a lot more cobblestone. Um, Cause I wanna have a stone roof. Um, that'll be easy. Cause I live right next to a freaking hillside, so that'll be nice. In case you're wondering, this lo-fi hip-hop music is like what plays in my head 24-7 if I'm not thinking about anything. This is just how it is. I'm gonna plant some trees. I'm gonna plant a tree in here. At least one. Do it in this little corner. There we go. And uh... Mm, yeah, that's fine. Do one tree there. No, I should do another tree here. There we go. And, um, I'll replant one here for the fuck of it. There we go. Now I'm gonna go back and bring some of the other stone. Because I had, I had a good amount of stone. 
So I just need to go back and get it. All right, I'm loaded up on things. Now I gotta go back. First things first, we need to make stone stairs, because that is what makes the roof essentially. We'll start with that. I think this is it. Hell yeah! Alright, so we have the edge of the roof completed. Now, okay, so I got that corner one yesterday. Okay. So now, we can just use the rest of the stone to make just stone blocks, and that'll be the top of the roof. Pop that in there. So we're gonna need a lot of fucking stone. Okay, so what I did last time is that you can get vines, and I covered the inside walls here with vines because it looked really nice. Um, I don't think I can do that though. Because there's no, you can only get vines in um, jungle or, uh, what's it called? Um, fuck. Not marshland. Swamp. In a jungle and swamp biomes, but I don't think there's any around me right now. So, hmm. I guess in the meantime, I can just start decorating the flowers. I'll oh, take some of these too. What are you doing, boy? You got okay. So I'll just decorate with some flowers. I'll put some here, put it here, put some dandelions going right here. There we go. Starting to look nice. And then of course I want my hay bales. Although I don't know if I have any. I did not bring any wheat. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'll start my wheat farm then. Might as well. So to start a farm, you need a hoe. And in order to make a hoe, you got this. Oh fuck, no, I didn't want that. And what you do is you need to be in your water. And then let's see, I'll make my farm over here. Maybe near water. I think it's like need to be like four blocks or something. Something like that. From water. And then you can use the hoe to make farmland. The water will move the farmland. And then you can plant seeds. It's just night time. Let me sleep. Okay, okay. Okay, you know what, I'll come back, I'll run and get my llamas, so this place starts feeling like a home, and then I'll, uh, I'll come back. And then by then, the roof, or the stone should be ready, so then I can make my roof, and then I'll be done. Alright, it is now time of the llama caravan and uh, this will truly be a test a testament to um, my abilities as a llama handler so the thing about llamas is that if you attach one llama to a lead the others will follow now the only way okay so this is what I'm going to do I'm going to attach this one to a lead now the other one is to follow Presumably. And now we're just gonna have a huge ass llama train. And yeah, okay, now we just gotta take things slow. 
And I uh, hope none of them fall into the water pit, which I think two just did. That's okay, we can come back for them. Okay. So we got three of them. We got half of them. We lost the other three, but that's okay. We'll come back and get... This bridge. Oh no, he already fell. Buddy. Okay, come on. Come back up, you. This is exactly what I was afraid of. I mean, at least they're kind of swimming towards me. But yes, please get on the fucking bridge. See, they wig out. They totally freak out over bridges. I don't know why. Please, sir. And I should have brought... I don't have a fence with me. But you can post them up, basically. Oh my god. And the other two. Come on! Oh man, I'm going to lose some of my llamas, I already know it. I'm just going to go slow, because it will keep up me. Okay. And it's almost night time. Which means I may have to leave them. Because they'll stick together. It's literally just a matter of getting them over the sea. Come on, buddy, you can do it. You can do it, yes. yes. So yeah, we lost another llama, but that's okay. We'll come back for him. Okay, we're almost there, boys. Come on. We're almost there. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm gonna cut it so close. This is why I like things up. Like, on the off chance, for some reason, I can't sleep immediately. Um. I need to be ensured that I'm not going to have mobs following me around. Yes! Let's see. Dope. Forgot how to unleash the llama. Oh, there we go. Oh, fuck. Oh, is one of these the ones that I didn't tame? Oh, what the heck? Oh my god, why is this spitting at me? Fuck. Hold on. I think I accidentally hit it. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That's why it was spitting at me, though. Okay. So, this gate, and I need to run. Because there's a lot of dark spaces around me. Including the top of my house. Spiders can spawn up there, and I do not want that. Okay, cool. How are they? Is he only 14 fucking stone? Clipped in the entire time? Jesus. Okay, well, this should be enough. Maybe. Nope, because I still have to do that back end. You know what? I'll just get the rest of them later. Cause I gotta pee. I'm tired. Please look at them. It would be very, very spacious for six llamas. It already loves the little overhang. Yes. 
Okay, cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed <laughs> this uh, Let's Play Minecraft. Oh god, this is a lot of work. But this was fun. And I showed you how I go about things. I do everything for my llamas. And uh, this, I... <laughs> This is it. This is what I. This is what I do when I say I play Minecraft. Uh, this is what I do. Yep. All right. Well, see ya. Thanksgiving weekend, I guess. Bye.